Patrick Mahomes just got injured against the Jags in the divisional round with two minutes left in the first quarter. The injury just took place on first and 10 with 2.39 left in the first quarter. The game's all tied up at seven. Mahomes drops back. He moves up in the pocket. The pressure is getting to him. He quickly dumps the ball up about five yards past line of scrimmage and takes a bad hit, getting sandwiched between two Jags defensive linemen. And Mahomes is showing that he is in a lot of pain. You never want to see a star quarterback get hurt. I mean, any player for that matter, but he's just showing that his right ankle is not okay. He can barely walk off the field. Like, he's just, he can't even move. He just takes a second to get himself together. Like, no chance he's staying on the field, right? And the play, it, it looks rough. It's definitely a right ankle sprain or... <laughs> Maybe a break, but it, it looks rough. You can see he's getting tackled, and then his right ankle gets caught under the Jags' left knee. Oh, it's it's hard to watch. Really, prayers out to Mahomes. That you never want to you never want to see any player get injured. This sucks. Then Mahomes is seen talking to this trainers and staff. Like, man, this shit hurts. <laughs> and I, I don't I don't you can't imagine what they're saying. They're probably asking him, "Do you want to stay on?" and <laughs> Just after watching the play happen, that he was just, he could barely even walk after. There's like, everyone's thinking there's no way this man's staying out. And it looks like Mahomes is staying out on the field. Kansas City's second string, Henny, he's warming up. He's like, maybe I'm gonna get a chance to play in a playoff game? Oh boy, I have to live up to Mahomes' standards. Well, it looks like Henny's not gonna play in a playoff game today because Mahomes is coming back out on the field. Mahomes got up off the bench and now he's limping back out to his team huddle and he's gonna play the next down. Now when I saw this happening I was like what the fuck is going on? He's barely able to get out there to his team huddle. He's limping. Is this really the best decision to put your star quarterback under center again when you could maybe like send him back to the training room and get him wrapped up and looked at? It was most likely Mahomes' decision to go back out there. He's tough. It, I'm nothing against him. I just would say you don't want to see the man getting hurt even more, but they're most likely going to run safer plays that aren't going to put Mahomes in danger, and that's what they do. They run the ball in second and six, and they pick up a good amount of yards. But disregarding the safety worries or whatever, this man is crazy crazy for going out here <laughs> he's so injured he can't even hand the ball off without skipping off the pressure so he doesn't have to land with his right foot <laughs> Mahomes is crazy for this bringing up third and two Mahomes is still out there and again he hands it off and they get the first down now after the first down you're thinking all right maybe now that they got the first down they'll take Mahomes out and maybe get him checked out because he literally can't use his right but, well, I thought they might take him out after they got the first down, and I was wrong. On first and 10, Mahomes drops back to throw, plants with his right back foot, and launches the ball over the middle to Kelsey. <laughs> He's out here dropping back and throwing passes with a bum ankle. But sadly, that is where it ended for Mahomes. He had had enough and he started limping off the field and it was Henny's turn to come out for the Chiefs. And Henny ended up doing fine in this drive. He led his team to a field goal and the Chiefs took the lead 10 to seven. But Mahomes has had it. He went down to the bench to take a seat and they're finally gonna go check out that bum ankle. It, good for him for show, staying out there. It shows dedication, it shows that he's tough, but we already know that Mahomes. We, we already know that you're gonna be the MVP of this season. We, we already know you're crazy. You don't need to prove anything. They, I think he should have just checked his ankle out right away so hopefully he didn't further it didn't seem like he would have further hurt it anymore but you never know and we get to see how dedicated Mahomes really is to his team how bad he wants to stay out there and play with a bum ankle that he can't even walk on or plant he slams his coat down right before he heads into the locker room to go get his ankle checked out it's kind of funny like man you know you gotta have to get your ankle checked out you don't want to further hurt it because hopefully the Chiefs can still win this game you might be able to come out in this game still and we, they want you for next week and luckily for Mahomes his team still picks him up as Henny leads the Chiefs down the field and connects with Kelsey for a touchdown and to take the lead 17 to 7 and Mahomes was back out of the locker room after this and he is fired up the game is currently at halftime the Chiefs are up 17 to 10 Henny has shown that he can still at least help the Chiefs maybe get this win besides that he should have been picked off earlier in this drive but that is besides the point he's shown that he can still manage this team and Mahomes current status is that he's questionable to return with an ankle injury and I I'm predicting that he'll probably stay out for the rest of this game if the Chiefs can maintain a small lead and 
there's not really a reason for him to come out. And I mean, his, his injury is pretty bad. He can barely walk on it. I'm guessing that he probably won't come back out on this field. But also, this game is far from over. The Jags could definitely come out on top of this game. 17 10, not really much of a lead. This can be a good rest of this game. And that's going to be the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed my content, I would really appreciate it. You can like and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And once again, thanks for watching.